With eight seasons and nearly 400 episodes, Peppa Pig is one of the most famous cartoons in the world, and no one can deny that. Wow! But do you know all the hidden details and Easter eggs in this amazing show? <laughs> Have you ever thought about what the characters in Peppa Pig, who are still kids, will become when they grow up? This is discussed in one episode, but George doesn't give the best answer when his mom asks what he wants to be when he grows up. So we theorized that Peppa's little brother might follow a musical career, and this idea didn't come out of nowhere. Well, not entirely. In one episode, Peppa gets a horn and tries to play it, but fails. Her parents also try, but can't make it work. The only one who can play it is George, the youngest in the family. Even with no musical experience, he outshines his older sister and parents. Sure, they played other instruments that George couldn't, but he's so young that he shouldn't know how to play any instrument yet. It's a clear sign that this dinosaur-loving piglet has a natural talent for horns. Imagine if he started practicing. It would only be a matter of time before he became one of the greatest musicians in Peppa Pig's world, maybe even playing in orchestras. Wouldn't it be awesome to see a scene like that in the future if George starts music lessons? I'd find that the coolest thing ever. <laughs> see how incredible Peppa Pig details can be? But that's just the beginning. Let's talk about the 12 hidden details and Easter eggs in Peppa Pig that you need to see. So jump into this wave, because Cinewave is starting. Peppa Pig is one of the biggest hits in animation, but that doesn't mean the show is too proud to acknowledge other cartoons. On the contrary, it even includes references to other shows now and then. One scene that probably has a hidden reference happens in the episode Best Friend, where we see a drawing of an orange-striped cat that looks a lot like a certain famous comic strip character who will soon appear in a new DreamWorks movie. Of course, I'm talking about Petey the Cat, the villain from Dogman. Look at how similar they are. Is it a coincidence? If so, it must be fate. Imagine how epic it would be if this was a cosmic sign of a crossover between Dogman and Peppa Pig in the future. Dogman would definitely feel at home in a world where everyone is an animal, just like him. Grandpa Pig and Grandpa Rabbit are great friends, and we're sure this friendship goes back decades since they both wear the same symbol on their hats, a symbol most people don't recognize. The symbol on their hats was used by those who served in the British Royal Navy, because if you remember, Peppa Pig is set in England. This Easter egg shows us that both grandfathers served as sailors in their youth. And knowing they're both quite old, there's a strong possibility they fought together against Germany in World War II. This is truly a friendship that no one could ever break. They must have saved each other's lives countless times. Daddy Fox is one of the shadiest characters in the series, as there's a lot of evidence that he's one of the biggest thieves in Peppa Pig's world. It's no coincidence that we see a Fox logo on a wall in the police station, a logo similar to the one he places on products in his shop. He's even seen passing by the police station with a suspicious look on his face, as if mocking the police. It's highly likely that everything he sells has been stolen at some point. And if all that stuff he has is stolen, oh my, Daddy Fox must have robbed half the world! Not to mention we see him sneaking onto a chicken farm late at night, just like a chicken thief would. How has Daddy Fox not been arrested yet? He must be really good at what he does to always avoid the police. Speaking of daddies, do you think Daddy Pig is funny? If so, go ahead and comment down below, hashtag daddy. In the episode London, the characters visit the UK's most famous city and ride on a red double-decker bus driven by the Queen herself. This is definitely a nod to the iconic buses that tourists often use in real life to explore the city. After all, Peppa Pig is British and tries to share a bit of its culture with fans from different countries. It's similar to what's done in Bluey, another show that proudly embraces its Australian roots and always finds a way to reference Australia in its episodes. This similarity makes a lot of sense, as Bluey was likely inspired by Peppa Pig due to its huge success and influence. We know that Madame Gazelle isn't just another character in Peppa Pig. She has many secrets, and one of her eeriest traits is that she's a vampire from Transylvania, as we've mentioned in other videos. Another lesser-known secret is that Peppa's teacher was once a rock star in her younger days. She was part of a band called Rocking Gazelles with her sisters, who kept making music after she chose a different path. And they seem to be pretty successful, as several records can be seen in their home. The question is, are Madame Gazelle's friends also vampires? After all, she only became a teacher after leaving the band. But we know she was already teaching when Peppa Pig's parents were kids, and the reason she hasn't aged a day is clearly because she's a vampire. Her friends must be just as old and still look young too. Unless these gazelles have the world's best skincare products, they're all definitely vampires, especially since they're sisters. If you've watched any episode of Peppa Pig, you'll know Peppa's family consists of four pigs. 
Daddy Pig, Mummy Pig, Little George, and Peppa herself. But there's a small detail on a poster from the show that suggests this basic info about the pig family might not be entirely accurate. On this poster, we can see a fifth pig peeking from a window of the pig family home, hidden as if he shouldn't be seen by anyone. There's never been an explanation for this mysterious pig in the poster. Could he be a character who was removed from the show, like an older sibling for Peppa? Or maybe Mummy and Daddy Pig had a child before Peppa who passed away in an accident. Perhaps Peppa and George don't even know they were supposed to have an older brother because their parents decided to keep it a secret, which would explain why he hasn't been mentioned in almost 400 episodes. All I know is, it doesn't make any sense for him to be in the picture without any explanation. Peppa Pig really is amazing, isn't it? If you want to see more videos from us about Peppa and other awesome shows, hit that subscribe button. There are some pretty funny little mistakes in Peppa Pig episodes that we usually don't even notice while watching. One of these slip-ups happens when Peppa is playing with her friend Rebecca Rabbit. There are several toys scattered on the floor, but the one to pay attention to is the one that simply disappears from one scene to the next. What happened here? Some mistakes work the other way around, where something appears instead of disappearing. That's the case with Daddy Pig's donut. When he starts eating it in the episode Secrets, his first bite already takes away more than half of it. But in the very next shot, contradicting the previous scene, Daddy Pig's donut is suddenly more intact than before. This has to be a continuity error, unless Daddy Pig can eat so quickly that he finished one donut and grabbed a new one in a matter of seconds. Honestly, I wouldn't put it past him. In the episode where George and Peppa Pig try on their parents' clothes, it's easy to notice that Daddy Pig's outfit is way too big for little George, trailing along the floor. Then, when George slips into his dad's shoes, something strange happens. Without any explanation, he's suddenly tall enough for the clothes to stop dragging on the floor. Daddy Pig's shoes definitely wouldn't make George that much taller, so this has to be some kind of error. Speaking of Daddy Pig, here's another mistake involving him. This time, it's during a scene where he's digging a hole. As he's pulling up the dirt, a little pile starts forming behind him. But then, from one scene to the next, something inexplicable happens. That pile of dirt completely vanishes without a trace. Another odd mistake happens during a pig family picnic when they get swarmed by bees. Amidst this sudden bee attack, hello Bee Movies Berry's cousins, we don't even notice a really weird error. The picnic blanket and food completely disappear without anyone noticing. Maybe they got so focused on the bees that they didn't have time to notice the weirdness. But since it was an animation error, the characters would never realize what happened. After all, it wasn't supposed to really happen in the story. The items come back later, and everyone acts like nothing happened. And with that, our video is wrapping up. If you want to keep having fun, click on one of the two videos on your screen. Thanks, and see you next time!